So do you know what I really like? I like a good steak, medium rare, some vegetables, fries, pepper sauce. Do you know what I also like? A company that listens to their customers and changes their products based on their feedback. Roll the intro. So hey everybody, this is Max the Dutch Gamer and welcome back to my channel. A couple of weeks ago, Boran Game CEO Marco got a hold of me and told me that they were sending me the first revision of their Xbox Series X wall mount. Yes, the one I had reviewed a couple of weeks ago. They told me that they had revised a couple of the key features that I'd mentioned in my review and that they'd like me to have a look at this version too. So let's get straight into the review, shall we? So first of all, when Marco and his team sent me the first edition of this wall mount, they told me they didn't have the right packaging ready just yet. But to my surprise, now they do. Would you look at this? Look at this. Let's see if I can actually, whoa, 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 look, look, whoa, 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 it's big. It's huge. Look at it. Smart design for your console. Supporto da parete horizontale per le console da gioco. I hope I said that right. Italian quality packaging, sir. Fantastic. So I opened it up, not knowing what to expect, but expecting that most of the things that I mentioned as cons in my previous review had been treated. And I'm glad to say that most of them have. So here are both of the mounts, version 1 and version 2. And first of all, if you look at them like this, you can't really see the difference, can you? Oh, but there is a difference. Let's get closer, shall we? So here you have version 1. This is the one I reviewed a couple of weeks ago. As you can see, it's got the two slats in the back to hide the cables, the cable slot where you can route your cables through, the ventilation slots here, the two slots for your two controllers, and of course, the headphone holder with a nice screw on the back. So one of the things I got a hold of Mark for a couple of weeks after getting used to this product was this screw here. This screw here was kind of digging into my Xbox and not really making a mark, but it would be if I left it there for a long time. So Mark said, I'll take a look at that and see if I have a solution for it. Anyhow, let's not go into reviewing our old product again, shall we? Let's get right into the new one. This is version 2.0 of the Boran Game Xbox Series X wall mount. Now let's go through some of the key differences. As I mentioned before, the screw on the previous version on the headphone holder was digging into my Xbox Series X. So I did mention this to Mark, as I already said, and he found a great solution, which was this cap for the screw. It's a plastic cap, it's very sturdy, but it's got a rounded end, which will make sure that your Xbox Series X won't get scratched, which is nice. Furthermore, one of the things that was shown on my previous video is that the thing was extremely stable, but there was a slight wobble to it, very ever so slightly. So what Marco and his team have done is to make this even more stable. And how have they done this? We're about to find out. As you can see here, there's a new metallic lining to this thing, and the same has happened to the back. That will make this thing even sturdier. Not to mention that the metal used in this edition is even sturdier than the previous one. This is something I'll show you once it's on my wall, but I'm already telling you there's a big difference. It's incredibly sturdy and it's not gonna move. Another difference from the previous edition is something I'll show you by turning it around. On the previous edition, there was this metallic latch that came out of here that was supposed to balance it against your wall and make it even more stable. Well, they got rid of it because they don't need that anymore because of the new metallic edges that they've built into the product. They don't need this thing sticking out over here. So the product is slightly smaller and even more stable. It's incredible. You'll see it on the wall. It's amazing. It's also slightly heavier than version one probably because they've been using a different kind of metal solution. So it's, it's, it's amazing, it really is. One of the main nags with version one was the game shelf, uh, which wobbled a lot being stuck underneath this thing. Now Marco has said that they're still working on a solution for that, but they don't have an update on that yet. So I'll focus this review on the main unit for now. I already mentioned that this unit uses a different kind of metal, which is slightly sturdier, but I just wanted to prove it. V1, if you moved it around a bit like this, bent, gave way a bit, 
by bending a bit. This is just unbendable. This is so tough. Now in true Apple style, just one more thing. Marco and his team were kind enough to include the following in their box. Now what is this you ask me? This is a USB to dual USB-C cable. Now this is an absolute excellent addition to the Xbox Series X because it will allow you to charge both your controllers on the wall mount. So that is absolutely fantastic. Nice. Now let's install this baby on my wall and see what it looks like, shall we? So I've had the second version of this wall mount on my wall for about one and a half weeks now and I've been trying to find any cons to it, any bad things with it, but I just can't seem to find them. So I've asked Marco and his team about the reason why this wall mount is a lot sturdier than version 1 and they actually gave me a very decent answer. We created more folds in the sheet which makes it a whole lot sturdier. Well there you have it. It definitely is a whole lot sturdier. You saw it in the video before. It doesn't bounce as much as the previous version used to. Plus, I love the new cap on the headphone holder screw. I also love the inclusion of the dual USB-C cable. Thanks to this dual USB-C cable, I don't have to route any more cables through the hole in the back of the mount, which saves up a lot of space and makes it look a whole lot tidier than version 1. All in all, I'm extremely satisfied with this wall mount. As I mentioned at the beginning of this video, I love it when companies listen to their customers and improve their products based on the feedback that their customers give them. And that's definitely the case here. Mark and his team has worked really hard to improve this product and to make it a worthwhile addition to your setup. And it definitely is a worthwhile addition. I absolutely love it. And it's not moving from my wall anytime soon. So I really want to thank Boran Game, Marco and his team for sending me this version 2.0 of their Xbox Series X wall mount. It is absolutely brilliant and it's very clear to me that you guys have been working very hard to make this the best product it could possibly be. And it definitely is almost perfect. If you like this wall mount and you want to get one for yourself, please visit the link down in the description below to visit Boran Games website and check out all the mounts that they have. They don't only have Xbox mounts, but they also have PlayStation mounts and Funko Pop stands, which is fantastic. Let me know in the comments below if you like what you saw here today and if you're planning on getting one of these excellent wall mounts for yourself. Also leave a like and subscribe if you want to see more of my videos in the future. Thank you so very much for watching and see you in the next video. Bye.